Most important things in coding was the skills. But I kept the Jolly Ranchers so it could remain the juice. It helped me notice real quick someone judging you. Then they put your shoes on, asking what they've been through. But I was gone off that cup, fucking up my mental. Those who I hurt off that shit just know I did not mental. Every man dies, but not every man lives. YouTube, what it do? It's your boy Jay So Taboo. We back with another video. Hey. I'm just start putting more hats on and turbans, do rags. I'm just put whatever on in my hair until I get a retwist slash haircut. I'm gonna get one next week, so just wait, y'all. But uh, this video, this is a pretty chill video. Man, 2024 is a whole movie, bro. This, like this life is a movie at this point. Um, if you didn't catch what my quote was at the beginning of the video, every man dies and not every man lives. What does that mean? And I, I can't remember where I found that quote from. If I do, I'm gonna just put it on the screen here. Um, what that means is like every man, we all on borrowed time. So it's like every man is gonna eventually, you know, pass away. Everybody's eventually gonna pass away. But not every man lives. So what does that mean? Even though you're alive in the flesh, it doesn't mean you're living. Like you could just be a walking corpse, just doing whatever, not enjoying life, not living into the fullest, not doing what you are desiring to do or not finding um, some, you know, good, and the bad and all that you know what i'm saying that's what duality and stuff is for that's what all this other stuff is for i'm just here to shed some light on that because you do want to live even if you're not in an ideal situation especially nowadays because like i said before 2024 is a movie Every, anything since 2020 up to 2024 now has been a fucking movie bro because life has just been kind of so unreal we just damn near desensitized to this shit at this point bro like bro we went from 2020 to the most deadliest virus in history, supposedly. We had people offing each other for toilet paper and chicken sandwiches, bro. And we look up all the way up to right now, bro. This year has already been pretty crazy, and it's just, and it's not even over with yet. Like, bro, like the Kendrick Lamar and Drake beef, you know what I'm saying? All the natural disasters going on around the world. Like, it, it's getting real out here, bro. It's, it's getting real out here, you know what I'm saying? It's just so crazy. That's what, and it makes you be a little more grateful for things because you definitely not promised another day. You never was in this life, but especially nowadays, you're definitely not guaranteed another day. So you might as well just do what the fuck you want to do. Of course, don't go around being a dipshit, but you know, you definitely gotta be more appreciative of things and just do what you want to do because. Anything can happen tomorrow. Nuclear fallout can happen tomorrow, bro. Zombie apocalypse. You feel me? Uh, global blackout, man. Man, we could be in a Terminator like situation where AI takes over and shit, and we have like a Skynet type situation. It's it's just getting real, bro. And my point in this message, what's the positive I'm trying to put out in this message? The positive is that I'm just saying that hey, go all in on whatever you gotta do. Stop waiting for the perfect moment because. People are dying left and right nowadays. You might not get the chance to tomorrow. So, you know, just get started on I mean, it. Don't wait to make a YouTube channel and create content. Don't wait to start streaming. Don't wait to start that business. Who gives a fuck if you fail, bro? You need to and or you gotta start now. That way, in the future, you given your blessed to see it. You know what I'm saying? You good, cause you've already went through the failures and what you have to learn and shit. Like, bro, you just gotta go all in on it now, bro. You just got to be grateful for how things, you just got to be grateful how it is now because despite all the darkness and crazy shit in the world because life right now is kind of fucked, there's a lot of good going on too, bro. There's people who have been changing their lives since 2020. There's been people who have just been on it, who have just flipped that switch and they've changed their lives just because the new energy that's coming onto the planet too you know what i'm saying you gotta take advantage of that bro like right if you believe it or not you can obviously see that there's a lot of people who also change their lives my bad i'm, tra I'm tracking the minutes on how to y'all there's a lot of people who change their lives too you know what i'm saying so you might as well be one of those people to change your life too i don't think you can bro you got a whole bunch of people changing their lives since 2020 to 2024 right now bro you gotta take advantage of that bro like you got to you gotta understand that there's more to this life than what you understand and you gotta understand you can do whatever you want bro you can really do whatever you want bro especially with what's going on now like bro never i was just talking to my cousins about this never in my lifetime 
Well, I thought we'd seen a failed presidential assassination attempt, bro. This, we really is in the movie right now, bro. Like, bro, I could see everything going on in life right now being on the big screen for like two or three hours because this is crazy, bro. Like, real talk, this is crazy. It's like real crazy. Then you got Earth, just all these natural disasters and stuff. You could tell something's going on, bro. Whether if you are atheist, whether if you are religious, whether if you're spiritual, whatever you category you're in, you can obviously tell the sun's going on right in the world. All over the world. You know what I'm saying? It, it don't take much to see that. But my whole message on why you poop, would you poop with you? What the fuck am I? I'm fucking my words up today, y'all. My bad. But my message on what you should pull from this video is just man go all in on what you need now and be grateful for life because it's a lot of fuck shit going on but hey you can also change your life too like there's people who really changing their lives since 2020 bro you just gotta look you know what i'm saying i know that it's been a lot of crazy shit since 2020 but man you can change your life bro you can change your life you feel me and even though you might say we're really fucked and it might be true we're still very blessed at the end of the day. You are still very fortunate at the end of the day, bro. The, the sun gets the sun gets to shine on your bum ass every morning, giving you an opportunity to wake up, do what you gotta do. A lot of people aren't gifted that, gifted that opportunity, so you know, just take advantage of that, man. The sun could just say fuck it, skip a couple hundred thousand years and just explode on our ass right now, <laughs> but nah. So you know, we gotta just we gotta take these things into thought you know what i'm saying but that's that's pretty much it though i just wanted y'all to stoop on that bro i want y'all to really go out there and live your life go after your dreams it ain't impossible it's only possible and not possible if you say it is because you really hold the power to control your reality and really the whole purpose of this video is to be like don't focus on all the negative since 2020 up till now because that reprogram your subconscious mind and mind over matter that creates your reality so you know you really have to just stay focused and stay on the grind man you know but hey that's it more lock content drill lock content when i get a retwist hopefully tuesday or wednesday and a haircut and all that you know what i'm saying but like share subscribe comment you dig um love yourself spread some peace don't be a dipshit. <laughs> Peace.